Hello, Rakil here with another video of Heroes and Generals. Today, I have enough money. And today I can talk about the same thing that I talked yesterday on my video yesterday. So, be first, I'm gonna unlock the new tank and replace it for this one. Okay, <clears throat> now that I have this new tank, let's see what it does. I think I already played, yeah, I played just a little bit because I st stole a tank from the teammate. So, yeah, I'm gonna j just jump into an assault game and then we will talk about that in the game. So, see you then. And we found the match. <clears throat> let's see. Oh, I didn't pick that one. Oh, I did. So, I, I now I have my new tank. Let's try it out. I already played it with some other tank. 99 bullets. That's weird. And the game was already started, so... Let's just go around. I regret my decisions, but let's see. Ah, shortcut. You cannot do that with the normal vehicle. You can, but it's it's basically luck. Oh, this tank is so big. No pun intended. Hmm. So, the last video that I wanted to talk about was about bots and about money in this game because. When you start up the game, you can get money. I sh I made the video how to make money pretty easy early on in the game. You just need the submachine gun. Then you need that vehicle for transporting that one that we have seven of. It's in the top, and the enemy has five of those. So those. And you can just go to free point game that you need to capture and hold that capture. And because when you capture, you get a lot of points. So that's how you make money early on in the game. And the other thing is, if you play sniper, like I did, um, because I like playing sniper. It's not really that great because the sniper is very expensive to upgrade and that stuff and it's very hard to upgrade it to max and What? Oh, that's oh, that's my teammate. Sorry, 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 sorry. Kill assist. Okay. Um, where was I? No, oh, yeah. <clears throat> I was talking about money because when I played the sniper game, one hour, one hour, and I got fifteen thousand. You would say, oh, that's a lot of money. Yeah, but I lost, because of reloading, 10,000. So I only got 5,000 out of that game. And that's very annoyingly not, not fair. What are these bots doing? And also... happening who's shooting me what should you get okay what the fuck is this game okay we're getting them 
Let me kill him. Yep, you're screwed, brother. Yeah, show me your butt to me. Let me end you. Right here and there. Okay, um, everybody's dead. Okay. So hard to see stuff. Okay. I'm gonna die this here, but it doesn't matter. I'm kill I'm killing the enemy. So, because I was too much focusing on killing the enemy, while I'm driving back, I'm gonna complete the story that I was telling. <laughs> because yesterday my mic just didn't work for some goddamn reason, didn't work. And I, I couldn't redo the video. I just couldn't because I ran out of time to do one. So, um, to literally, the only way to gain a lot of money is by playing a normal soldier or the tank driver. Because the normal soldier, you play that game mode that I told you about, and you use those easy things to get. That's how you start to gain money. Like, it's kind of harder, but that's how you begin. And then you can just upgrade to tank driver, like I am. And when you get that, it's kind of hard at the start, but when you get your first tank, upgrade those bullets, you will get money for days. That's why if you play tank, you will get a lot of money and you will lose absolutely nothing. And that should be changed because the most you will lose is may maybe just maybe about under 2000 that's basically it you will not lose any more than low low 2000 and it's annoying because you get 10,000 or even more it depends how much tanks you kill because when you kill tanks you actually you actually get a lot of XP and when you get a lot of XP you get a lot of cash that's basically it okay I guess they killed him so by playing tank you will get a lot of money you can upgrade everything you want and that stuff with the sniper you need to play him and you will lose a lot of money because you need to use your gun to do damage because you need you want to upgrade your tank not tank, your piss, your main piss gun so you can so you can actually do damage right, because you upgrade your sniper so you can one shot people I see you down there god damn, this gun is so hard to use somebody shoot me at the bag back, back bag Ah, there you are. Ah, teammates. Where is he getting all of those bullets? Okay, he blow up my wheels. Hopefully there's... Okay, no enemies. Right here. Okay, that's my teammate. Good. Okay, where was I? Is that an enemy? Bastard, you're not gonna hide from me. Okay. Let me fix this. So it's there is no literally if you wanna gain money, it's no point to play sniper because it's not worth it. Because you're not gonna get much money. You're gonna get maybe two thousand, one thousand, five maybe five hundred, maybe even ten thousand if you're lucky. Because basically what you do with the sniper is just kill people. That's it. You don't do anything different. Because there's no point of doing anything different. Who's got them shooting me? How did I miss? I need to turn and move backwards. What? Mm. Nice try. I cannot turn. I cannot turn. Ok, 
Okay, that car is dead. Okay, I need to escape. I need... Okay, I'm dead. So, the, the only way to... The only point of playing Sniper is to have fun. Because I play him to have fun. Literally, that's the only point. And it's fun. I like it. I like it, but... It's literally, if you want to continue playing, like achieving other guns, upgrading stuff and that stuff, it's better to play someone else because Sniper is pretty weak and you you can gain money with Sniper if you use the, the vehicles that can shoot, like the f first tank and the second tank that, sh that came out some time ago when I started recording, basically. So those those vehicles, those vehicles are late game and very late game. It's very hard to get as well because you need to upgrade your transport, right? And that's not easy with the sniper because you you have two shitty things. And now especially because they are bots, and I saw bots teleporting to my vehicle or jumping on my vehicle, and they don't give you XP. They should make it so they can give you XP at least. And bots are so stu stupid that people like Sniper, you can shoot bots, right? You get a lot of kills. I got 47 kills. Literally, 47 kills on bots. And it was epic. It was very, very, very fun to play that. And the problem was nice block. Where where am I getting shot? Where? Down there I cannot see anything there. That's bullshit. Okay. Let me go back to this tank and let's go again. So, I got a lot of money. I lost a lot of money because of the ammo refill. I got like 1000 points because snipers supposed to point where enemies are and kill people because that's all he can do because you cannot buy a bazooka. No, you cannot buy a bazooka. You cannot buy air thingy bajingy so you are a vulnerable target only in late game you can do something like you you have protection because you can get the scope so they cannot see so they cannot seal the kill cam so that that's an upgrade for sniper but still you lose money by shooting your own gun so you will need to find a sniper that's high level kill him and use his sniper and only then you can actually do something And he killed my great. I guess I'm gonna be the heavy bullet thing. Ah, I destroyed his as well. Nice. But I, my bullets don't do sh damage. And that's weirding me out. What tank do, do you have? Okay. He's dead at least. Let me fix it. So, there's literally no no point of playing other classes. Like, I was playing, and also, I was playing a free, freeway war, right? And that war was so bullshit, because you can see bots roaming, right? The normal soldiers, those are bots. And they don't use your, your thing, your soldiers respawn. They don't use that so you can shoot them in infinitely infinitely and you will not gain a lot of money because you're gonna lose money if you don't use another person's gun it's totally not fair because bots have unlimited response and you will mostly lose more money than gain you, you will gain more money than lose but you're not gonna gain that much money because you're gonna usually lose all of it. So... A 
that's basically it. And they, we also had parachuters, so all the person, nobody was playing a normal soldier. All everyone was playing parachuter, and it was bullshit because parachuters would get on the point, get a lot of XP from capturing the point, and that yada 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 things, and it will. And you can kill them. You they will they are like 170 respawns. That's a lot, but logically, right? And there are infinity soldiers because bots. So bots will get on the point. Get, get they will not do that much, but still they will capture points, kill people, and you will not gain anything from killing. You can kill them, capture point, and get that, but not with the sniper. Oh, he's up there. Darn. So, yeah, we had to kill all of the... All of the parachuters, and then, after that, kill the enemy soldiers. The snipers, we got to, took care of it, because snipers didn't have a lot of response. I only died t t 12 times with the sniper. And it was bullshit how much money I lost. Just dying twice with the sniper. I lost 10,000 cash from dying twice, 12 times. I, I killed 75 people, right? I had the max. I, my sniper is totally maxed, but I didn't get the trigger because there is no point. Because you lose even more money if you get the trigger and you're gonna get a higher attack speed with your gun, but. Worse aim. It's literally no point. So, <clears throat> literally no point. And so, that game took an hour. We won, after all, but still, we didn't we didn't get anything. Anything that that would was worth it playing that whole one hour game. Five thousand. That's all. I was 6th place on my teammate squad. Where is the... I don't see the enemy. That's okay, I don't have to. Um, was there a rock underneath me? There was. Oh, we lost. Oh, well. That was a fun game, at least. I tried the, the new tank. I didn't talk anything about the new tank. Literally, any, nothing. I was just talking about the other things. So, 4,900. That's a lot. I didn't do that much. I didn't even... Oh, look how much money I lost. 500, maybe around 700. And I got 4,000. I got a lot more than lost because I didn't use... I actually lost more money because I used the normal weapon. But that normal weapon had no bullets, literally. Um, so yeah, there is no point of playing any others, I don't know about planes because I don't play planes, I tried it, I, I, it wasn't that fun for me, the, t the tanks are very efficient of getting money, and snipers, sometimes if you have this tank or this one, you need, be, you need to be very care careful, because you can kill the other tanks, right, but there's no point because you cannot upgrade bullets. You have openings that people can shoot you right through with any kind of weapon. Parachuters are the worst against snipers. It, you can maybe survive if you don't have if you have this maybe, but they can still see the tank. That's why I camouflaged it a little. And planes are very annoying now because they. I was riding with the sniper with this bicycle and this one, and they were just drop bombs. 12 times in a row they would kill me instantly, I had, to, I had to wait like a minute to respawn because my gun is maxed. And that uses a lot of points of respawning with this weapon, right? Or vehicles. It totally destroyed me. So, they will need to change just a little bit about upgrades that they will not cost so much when you use it. 
or the bullet to refill. They will, they will have to change it a little or some because with sniper you will get only 2000. That's still a lot of cash, but one hour game only 5000. That's like wasting 30 minutes of your life. You could play two games and got more. Sh two short games and you got more with Sniper. But no. 12 deaths. 10,000. So. I don't know. It's kind of, I'm kind of losing the fun of it. Because the most powerful soldier in everything is the normal one. Because you can have literally everything. Everything. What uh, what you want? You want to kill planes? There you go. You want to kill tanks? Here you go. You want to kill people? Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Add everything. Every single weapon. Here you go. Long range. Here you go. A little lo lower rank scopes, but still. Here you go. You have it. I hate that they changed it. So. Yeah, that's basically it. And one trick. If you wanna level up fast, the easiest way is with a tank or with a normal soldier. I don't know about planes, but with with the tank, with the tank, you just use tanks, get money, upgrade tanks, go get more money, win more games, kill more tanks, para high, a lot of XP, a lot of money, and you will upgrade soon. I didn't play that much with the tank, and I'm already here. Sniper, I'm playing it, playing him since I start, and I'm close, but so far from this goal, and I'm not getting any money. And with the norm, this soldier, it's easy. You just have a bazooka or two bazookas to get two bazookas. It's just put a bazooka in your inventory, go to store, go to weapons, and then. You pick a class, you click grenades, oh, you scroll down, oh look, a bazooka, and buy another one, and tara, you have two bazookas. And you don't have to, upg you need, you don't have to upgrade your weapon, literally, because if you have two weapons, you can just put the po points on, the uh, parts on, because you already bought them. So yeah, I don't know, that's probably a glitch, that's probably gonna get fixed, but just more you know um, what else can I say I think that's probably everything so hopefully they will recognize that bots are not that efficient they, was, they could just I, I don't know kill people get more more points I don't know it's hard <sighs> so yeah the best way is just buy a machine gun, don't upgrade it, and then go play. But not with the sniper, don't do that because you have low respawns and it's pointless. With soldiers, bots infinity respawns, a lot of respawns, so they are the most efficient out of all of them. Parachuters are the second most efficient because you just drop anywhere, get this gun, and that's it. I'm probably gonna, when I finish the tank, I don't know, maybe I'm gonna go parachuter or even plane, because I really wanna finish the tank, buy all the tanks I can, all of them, and that's basically it. For weapons, there's no point of getting any weapons, no point. And with a parachuter, the only point is to get this weapon, and that's it. Get this weapon, ma don't max it because you're gonna lose money. And that's basically it. You cannot drive planes. Colors don't, doesn't really that ma doesn't matter that much. Grenades you can get them if you want to get more cash by killing tanks. But good luck with that. Melee weapons no point. Healing items yeah that would work, but no point because they have they don't have a lot of space I guess. So that's it. I told I told you how to get more money. I I don't know anything about the plane because I don't play it. Hopefully this time the voice recorded properly, and hopefully I can see you in the next video. Hopefully enjoy this game of the new tank. 
It's pretty good, but it could be better. I leveled up some, so I'm closing on the upgrading bullets. I got this much XP, I got this color, and I'm getting to healing, and then I'm gonna upgrade bullets, and that's it. Wait a minute, what are these bullets? Um, wait, uh, just a little personal, yeah. No point. No, there is a point, but sh don't buy it if you don't need it. Like me, I'm, I'm not gonna need it. So, hopefully enjoy it and see you in the next video. Please comment down below, I will read all of the comments. And thank you for your support. And see you in the next video. Bye.